Scariest moment of your life? I thought I had herpes once. She texted me saying, hey, thought I should let you know that I have herpes. Why didn't she let you know the night before? That's what I was saying. Name the scariest moment of your life. The scariest moment of my life. Man, there have been a couple that have really rocked me to my core. I have to think about that one. Probably when my mom speaks English to me. <laughs> when she goes English. Then you know you're really in trouble. Uh, what was the scariest moment of your life? One time when I was flying, when we were taking off the plane, like, dropped significantly. I was traveling abroad one time, there was like a fight in the street and some guy pulled out a sword. Anytime I see a spider, I don't care, get me the fuck out. I had a shrooms trip. The effects of the drugs on my brain are my body's way of telling me that I'm, I've been poisoned and I'm actually dying. I've been lost to tornadoes from the Midwest. I always thought that was just a part of normal life. I walked down to a coffee shop. I ordered my drink, handed the card. Next thing I know, I woke up bleeding from my head. I had mono, and apparently mono-induced seizures are a thing. What's the scariest moment of your life? I was camping with my family, and my daughter had a seizure in the middle of the night, and we didn't know what to do. Luckily, we had our camp neighbor. She was a nurse, so she gave my daughter CPR. Her eyes would always roll back. She was crying, and I, I think that was like, the moment where I felt the weakest of, I didn't know what to do. Yeah. My wife had our second kid at the birth center. When my son came out, he was gray and wasn't breathing and wasn't moving. And then I saw my midwife's face and I got really terrified. The midwife assistant brought the baby into the water and rubbed him in there. And then he got color in his skin and began to cry. And for those 30 seconds, I thought, uh, I thought the worst. How does your body react when you're scared? I get shaky a little bit. Heart palpitations. My mind is just running. Like so many different like questions in my head. What's the scariest moment of your life? Ooh. Oh, the scariest moment of my life. There's a lot. When I came out to my family, I had to come out to my grandma over the phone. What was grandma's reaction? She was definitely in denial. I was in Hawaii with my boyfriend at the time. We were sitting in a parking lot and a car goes by. And they like slow down and glare at us with this look of just like contempt, disgust. And they zoom into the parking lot that we're in and I just grabbed my boyfriend's hand and stood up and ran. We found a thrift store, <laughs> sorry, and they, they let us come in, they let us hide in back. It was just terrifying. What's the scariest moment of your life? The scariest moment of my life was being homeless. We had to evacuate from a wildfire. I went to Europe with an influencer, he essentially groomed me and then confessed his love for me in Paris. When I didn't reciprocate feelings, he mentioned how he wanted to kill me. Yeah, so. That's horrifying, I'm yeah. sorry. <laughs> What's the scariest moment of your life? Probably when I was raped. He said, I thought you would have said yes anyway, so. Violence in my childhood by people I trusted. My dad was physically abusive to my mom for a long time. He had her hair and was uh, drowning her in a bathtub. And I was watching that. How old were you? Seven, six or, se six or seven. Tell me about the scariest moment of your life. When I got third degree burns. Broke my back. First time that I got COVID. My brother, he broke his neck in high school. Going in for a surgery. I had a spinal cord injury. How did the injury happen? Bungee jumping. <laughs> I accidentally dried my cat in the dryer. Finding him after my mom found him was probably the most terrified I've ever been in my life. What's the scariest moment of your life? I got into a car accident. Car accident? Car accident. Car accident. Where the car has skid out a couple times and I had hit um, both sides of the freeway. My life kind of flashed before my eyes. When I was 15, I was driven off of a 300 foot cliff. There was like a lot of blood and it was really traumatizing. It just shook me. I thought I might die, but I did make it back safely. My mom was in the car with me and I just had like a, a flash of like, what if I had accidentally killed my mother? It was terrifying in that moment to be like, Oh my gosh, like I could have just killed someone. What's the scariest moment of your life? 
I almost drowned when I was a kid, when I was like eight years old. There was an undercurrent and I was being swept farther and farther away from the shore. Once he like had walked back to the beach, he was just like ghostly white. It was like really scary to see my dad like that. What's the scariest moment of your life? I've had a lot of medical problems. When I got diagnosed with type 1 diabetes, my appendix was in the wrong place. It was all the way back here and it should be right here. I would have these problems where like, I would just like experience paralysis. Some of my scariest moments have been, oh no, is my life like kind of over? Like how am I gonna get past this? What's the scariest moment of your life? Almost losing my burner. He has cancer. Realizing eventually my grandmother who raised me would die. When my mom had a stroke. My dad passed away when I was young. And my dad was having a seizure. Was he okay after? Um, that was the start of his of us discovering that he had terminal brain cancer. The doctor's telling her that it was very possible she was going to die. Uh, the morning that my grandfather died, we're just like seeing this happen, and it, that was pretty awful. Someone who I've grown up with and have idolized and loved and has like watched me grow is like no longer here. Right after my dad died, I was hiking. He fell off a cliff, so I was uh, looking down and I just remember shaking like I could not even move. It never really gets like easier losing someone that you really love. You just find ways to just kind of look at more of like the, the beauty and what you were able to experience. You know, I wish I still had that, but um, yeah. What's the scariest moment of your life? Um, when I was 15, I was driven off of a 300 foot cliff. It was my best friend at the time's boyfriend. Um, they got in a fight. Next thing I know, he just turned up the radio and stepped on the gas. I just remember seeing the curve coming and then he didn't stop and just started driving towards it. And then I remember the car tipped over the edge of the cliff and I realized that the headlights didn't reach the bottom. And I just remember thinking, this is gonna hurt a lot. And then I just closed my eyes. Um, but that caused a lot of PTSD and also it was really scary. 300 feet, we flipped three times. Um, hit the mountain every time we flipped on the way down. Did everyone survive? Yeah, everyone survived. I was the worst hurt. Pretty much like all of the left side of my body was broken and I had to be in a wheelchair for almost two years. Um, and just a lot of physical therapy and recovering after that. Oh my God! So how many people out of 100 said they pooped their pants? 60, I would hope. I'm not the only one that's pooped their pants. You just might be. No, really? I'm kidding, no. Okay. Keep it 100. It's a game. Oh